Hello everybody and welcome. We just hit a milestone and today we're here to talk about it. But we already talked about things in a row. Uh, we've, we've done two of these update videos in the past week. Which is why we're not just doing an update video. There's a little something after the update, you know what I'm saying? So basically, we hit 500 subscribers. Um, it's, it's at exactly 500 subscribers right now. So, you know, could always change. It could always go down a couple or something like that. But as of right now, we have hit... 500 subscribers and that is exactly halfway to a thousand subscribers which is the uh the thing that we need to hit to be able to earn money off of youtube basically we're halfway there we're halfway there to being an actual youtuber and that's that's exciting so yeah that's that's a pretty cool milestone to hit thank you all for actually subscribing and sticking around and all that stuff and commenting watching the videos really just anything helps out and i appreciate all of it even if you've you know, I, I know that every YouTuber says this, but even if some motherfucker only clicked on the video one time and watched it for four seconds, that is still helpful to me. That still helps out a ton, and I still appreciate it. Even if they were angry the whole time they watched my video, you know, this person's like, <coughs> arms crossed, pissed off the entire time, like a, a grumpy grandpa or some shit. <coughs> Even if that is the case, I still appreciate it because, you know, at the end of the day, it's getting me closer towards um, the goal that I want, which at the end of the day, the goal that I want is to be able to earn money doing something that I like. And uh, YouTube, this form of YouTube at least, happens to be a lot of things I like. Um, it's doing comedy, you know, making jokes, uh, trying to make people laugh, that kind of thing. Playing video games. I love me some video games. You know I do. <laughs> then we got like actual like theory crafting and like lore creating theories and writing stuff down like having to think and like you know interacting with people that are like oh man that was a cool video like that's what's cool about doing youtube um and that's exactly why i'm gonna start replying to more comments i know that this is a little bit of a tangent a little bit non-related but i've noticed recently that i don't reply to nearly as many comments as i should so um, now I'm basically challenging myself to respond to every single comment. Speaking of comments, damn, my transitions are nutty. You gotta respect it. You gotta respect it. Uh, if you guys have any questions that you want to ask, Q&A style, you know, uh, ask them in the comments because we're about to do a test, uh, uh, a test of sorts, um, on this video. So I figured this is like the perfect video to, to have that on, to do like a Q&A type of thing. Um, and if there is enough comments in the comment section, I'll make a whole video about it. As long as there's like eight minutes of footage, that's like, what, six comments? Because I ramble for so long. <laughs> so yeah, if we get like six comments, I, boom, that's a full video. I got it. I got it unlocked. Um, but if we don't get that many comments, I'll just respond to them in the comment section. Um, but we'll see. For now, let's actually jump into the thing that we're here to do because we're doing a virtual content creator threat exam. That's right. How threatening am I? That's the question that we're asking today, and that's the question I'm answering today. Am I a threat? You ask me. You answer me. Wait. <laughs> the answer is no, but let's do this test anyway. Let's test our skills. Let's see how content creator we are. Welcome to the virtual content creator threat VCCT exam. In light of our recent growth within the virtual content creator space, the blank have set a requirement that all virtual content creators must be ass assessed. Alright, I gotta get assessed, I guess. Please note that accessing the whatever exam in infers that Radicated has taken all necessary steps to prepare you to over- I can't read. It's fine. Oh my, that's too much. Your job is to identify and classify the severity of all presidented virtual content creator threats presented. I actually read that whole thing. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> Stop the exam immediately if you experience any or all of the following. Lightheadedness, dizziness, extreme fatigue. Um, okay. Convulsions, disembodied singing, voided bells. Alright, well... We appreciate your service. I didn't do anything yet. Good luck. Okay. Uh, is this virtual YouTuber a threat? Uh, uh, it depends. It depends. Are these actual VTubers? <laughs> okay, so here's, here's the thing about this one. 
I don't think this is a threat at all because just like I don't think anything evil has that smile you know what I'm saying but I guess you know kind of Monokuma you know a little bit but not really no threat no threat you're not a threat no threat no threat is this virtual youtuber a threat now that one's more questionable but I say no too many hearts too many hearts no threat they're like an anime character <laughs> Wow, great commentary. I mean, is this virtual YouTuber a threat? Uh, no, well, maybe if you're dating them. <laughs> they look like they, <laughs> they're kind of crazy. But I feel like if you're not in a super close relationship with them, you're probably good. I would say they're not a threat. Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? No, that's just Hatsune Miku. That's like normal Hatsune Miku. I don't know what you're talking about. Not a threat there. That's normal. Okay. <laughs> okay. We'll linger on it a little bit. We'll linger. Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? That one's questionable. He kind of looks like he could breathe fire, you know? That's that's threatening. <laughs> We're going to say threat. He looks like he could breathe fire. What is the threat level? Uh, you know. It's like a it's like a it's like a medium, you know? Like a medium. Like a medium. It's about a medium. It's about a medium. Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? No, no, like I said earlier, anything with that smile cannot be a threat, you know what I'm saying? No threat, no threat. <laughs> that almost got me. It almost did. Oh shit, I, I know who this is. This is um Ross's uh wife or whatever, Giwi. I know this. I know this. Uh, Rubber Ross. Uh, that's not his name anymore. Uh, no, it is, right? What? Am I stupid? <laughs> the point is, this is Ross's wife. Uh, and they are definitely a threat. What is the threat level? I'd say it's a pretty severe threat. I'd say it's a pretty severe threat. Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? These are real U virtual YouTubers then. Uh, they're just... <laughs> they're just fucked with. And... They look like a juggalo. I'd say they're a little threat. <laughs> like this lighting really makes them look like they 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 got that makeup on. You know what I'm saying? Let's say it's low low threat. Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? I mean, probably. It looks like that they could probably take an entire chunk out of your face FNAF style. So I'd say they're kind of threatening. Threat level, that's like a... That's like a high threat level. That's like a high threat level. <laughs> Is this virtual YouTuber a threat? No, they're just the thing from Undertale. There's no threat there. They're like the Amalgamate. You remember that. You remember? I remember. We good? Your time is up. Did I do... What's my score? It's too late. Wait, no. What's my score? They're here. Oh my god. Here, ooh. Click, click, click. No, okay, so. Ooh, you knock it on the door. <laughs> that was smooth as fuck, game. Okay. We got a full on transition to, to actual gameplay. Also, this is so loud, so this jump scare is actually about to get me. Don't do it. My mic stand is drifting downwards. We good? Oh, it's the things that I wasn't supposed to hear. Okay. I want to look behind me, but I don't want to miss this. Okay, I looked behind me very quickly. I didn't see anything at all. <laughs> you good? Wait, can I... Here, can I do something here? You good? Are th is this Five Nights at Freddy's 5 a.m. type shit where you're about to come out at a random time? Or are we good now? Oh, that's actually really fucking cool. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. What? It Who's that? <laughs> I'm playing along now. Who was that? 
Where who knocked on my window? Guys, I don't. <laughs> God damn it! So here, yeah, I don't know where though. Is he like under my desk or something? Ooh, to back there. Okay, virtual katana. Okay, that was it. <laughs> So the jump scare didn't get us, but I really like that transition. I think I think the fact that it's VTubers uh, just completely took away any element of horror to that. Um, but I really like this. It's a you know, it's a it's a it's a spoof off of the classic uh, these types of games that got popular for a good bit there on itch.io where people do a test and that's the that's the game. We played a couple of the, we I think we played like all of them that are available now because we've played this one too. So we got all those done um also this was great this was <laughs> i just i really like the transition from like computer screen to third person perspective i like the the pixel face showing up in the door that's really cool uh the singing was pretty creepy not uh you know not like terrifying or anything but it was it was really good i like this a lot the even the graphics were really solid for showing up for actually like a minute like barely being there at all they they put a lot of effort into it they had a full-on room with an alarm clock and like a lamp there was stuff in that room like a person was you could tell a person slept in that room and that's that's cool that's cool to see because a lot of the times it's just like an empty room with like a bed <laughs> you know but yeah overall this is really cool if you want to check it out for yourself i'll leave a link in the description down below we hit 500 subscribers if you want to push that number up go you know what to do you know what to do hit that subscribe button you know i appreciate it i you know you heard me talking about it in the beginning you know i appreciate it <laughs> speaking of things i appreciate thank you for making it this far in the video i appreciate that too i'm saying it a lot you know i'm, I'm gonna it's gotta be my catchphrase at this point i appreciate it <laughs> Either way, though, that's the end of this one. Like and subscribe and all that shit, it helps out a ton. If you want to see more videos I've made, they're appearing on screen now. Or at least they should be. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Peace out.